Ooh, good morning to you guys. Yes, the largest black owned bank in the nation introduces a brand new limited edition card in celebration of Black History Month. But folks are livid this morning and here's why. One United Bank, well, it features Harriet Tubman on the Visa debit card. You see it right there on your screen. And although people appreciate the tribute, many are disturbed by what looks like a Wakanda Forever salute from the Black Panther movie. Now, the bank says the card is a symbol of black empowerment and the company hopes it will have or it's going to pave the way for Harriet Tubman's design on the $20 bill. This company, this bank, they missed the mark. Yeah. Why would they think that it was okay to not use a real picture of Harriet Tubman, but this old fake picture that somebody puts together and literally for it to have the Wakanda Forever salute, that's just kind of tasteless to me. Kinda? Yeah. It's, a, it's a bad image uh, altogether. Uh, it's just, just really weird. Uh, weird flex, you know, uh, and, and for a, a credit or debit card, uh, you, you just what money will be going to a good cause? Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if you're going to put the picture on there, would it go to a cause that she would have supported down the line? No. I don't know. No. Look, I say it all the time. Diversity is needed at the top. But when I say diversity, I'm not just talking about black or whatever. I'm talking about different nationality, ages, cultures, because that way you get different perspective. People are experiencing different things in life. And you would hope when you have so many different people at the top, mm -hmm. they'll make a right decision, a tasteful decision. Certain things, certain people demand, deserve more respect. Harriet Tubman oh, is certainly one of those people. And this gets a, a big fail. And this is the largest black owned bank. I'm just going to say it. This is why folks are upset. This is the largest black owned bank in the nation. Mm -hmm. You ex better. expect better. Yeah.